Hey Tommy TTK here. We are trying out Star Citizen with dual joysticks, which we are now able to use thanks to the latest patch, which has added custom control settings. Hey Logitech Extreme 3D Pro on the right and my Thrustmaster T16000M on the left. So I found my uh, pitch on the right hand stick there, the roll as well, and the yaw, your normal joystick controls. And then on the left, on the Thrustmaster, I've got the vertical and lateral thrusters. If I push forward, I go down, pull back, I, I uh, move upwards, and then left and right. I would say at the moment, it's pretty sensitive, particularly on... There you go, <laughs> I'm reading out already. Particularly on those lateral and vertical thrusters. A tiny bit of pressure on that stick, and I'm going at pretty much maximum acceleration. Uh, so that needs some adjusting. You can see just putting tiny amounts of pressure, just a finger on that stick. And my pilot is going to... Yep, there we go. He starts to red out pretty easily just from a tiny bit of pressure on that uh, vertical thrust there. So that needs some adjusting, I'd say. But it's promising. I like that you can have that control. And there's a lot of options to uh, configure your controls. So let's jump into a race map now and try this setup on this mode so i'll uh, point out i do actually have a set of thrustmaster racing pedals under my desk which in elite dangerous i do use for my forward and reverse thrusters that's not currently supported so what i'm doing is uh, the thrustmaster has a small throttle dial just on the base behind the joystick there I'm actually placing my palm onto that throttle and then using my fingers just to apply tiny bits of pressure to the vertical and lateral thrusters as I go through the gates which is all you need at the moment because it's so sensitive so I'm able to do that uh, hopefully in future updates they will add support for pedals and adjust the sensitivity and the and the curves on these joystick controls here to make it a little less uh, sensitive, a little easier to control. But I would say in this race mode, it is quite a nice way to uh, play this game. I haven't really touched this game yet. I've been sticking mainly to Elite Dangerous because I haven't been able to adjust the controls in this game uh, to, to interesting setups like this. But suddenly in the racing mode, it's getting a lot more fun and interesting to play. It requires some optimization, however. I'm running a fairly, fairly beefy system that should be able to run this. I'm actually recording this section in 720, 30 FPS and medium graphic settings because it just can't quite handle it. It needs some optimization for sure. But there you have it. Dual joysticks now possible in Star Citizen needs some sensitivity improvements and addition of pedals and it will be excellent so that's it i've got two laps left continue watching if you want to see more of dual joystick action in star citizen
checkpoint.